April 15, 2015 marked the beginning of a new annual Boston tradition. One Boston Day, and each year the day serves as an opportunity to celebrate the resiliency, the generosity, the strength demonstrated by the people of Boston and around the world in response to the tragedy of April 15, 2013. And today she'll be throwing out the ceremonial first pitch. Adrian Hazlitt, a survivor of the April 15, 2013 Boston Marathon bombing. She lost her left leg below the knee, and she says to this day, I refuse to be called a victim. I am not defined by what happened in my life. I'm a survivor defined by how I live my life. And, you know, she's going to get a wonderful ovation here in just a couple of moments. We think back to those horrible days and how strong everybody was. Boston strong from that day forward. Just incredible. Adrian Hazlitt. 2013 marathon. She vowed to dance again, and she did. And now, as she makes her way to the mound, we wish her well as she prepares to run her first marathon this Monday in support of Limbs for Life, which provides life-changing prosthetics for fellow amputees in need. Please give a warm welcome to Adrian Hazlitt. Catching her pitch is Clay Buckles. All right, Adrian, let's see a strike. Well, wonderful for Adrian and all of us here at Fenway Park. And Clay Buckholz catching the ceremonial first pitch on what will be a beautiful night here at Fenway, the Red Sox, and the Toronto Blue Jays. About to go at it in the first of a four-game series.